All right, what is going on guys? So this video is, um, it's, it's actually a couple days late. I went fishing the next day and that video you guys will be seeing tomorrow. We went out, we caught a, we caught fish. We caught good fish. You know, there wasn't like a ton of, ton of bites. We'd get like, uh, I think we got like six to eight bites that entire day, but we capitalized on all our bites. We got big fish and it was really good. You guys will be seeing that video tomorrow. I went out fishing this morning and it was not, let's just say I was going to have a double upload today. You guys are going to see this video in another video, but the thing is, is there's no way I could have made a video today because the freaking wind was like 30 mile an hour. I got out to like drove a couple hours out there and then realized, you know what? I can't even, I can't fish. It's really dangerous. So anyway, so you guys are getting this video. So the winner, the guy that I'm bringing down, it's a guy, I, I believe, unless it could be somebody's parent. I don't know. Um, TJ Osteen. Send me a message on here. Send me an email. I have an idea of who you are, I, I know what your address is and stuff, so I'll be able to verify if it's the correct TJ Osteen, but anyway, you want a trip, dude, um, or a gal, if it's somebody's parent, I don't really know, I guess we'll find out, but TJ Osteen, send me a message, I'll be, if, if you don't send me one in a couple days, I'll send you an email, I'll try to get linked up, so, yeah, I hope you guys enjoy this video, and uh, wait till tomorrow's video, it's got some good big bass. Well, what is going on YouTube today? Um, well, I got a really badass toy I'm going to show you guys here in a little bit. But I got this giant box of mail. Huge box of mail. I uh, really do thank you. I really hope this is what's in this thing. Because this is cool. Whoever sent this. It's a really, really nice tripod. It could be just... I feel, I feel like it's in there. I, I want to open it up, actually. That's what we're going to do. Who's this? Corey Harrison. Open this up. I know a knife just looked like it probably just randomly appeared. But... Miss your guns and chicken strips sitting off in the distance. Hi. Oh yes, it is a tripod. He was testing with me, he's like, it's probably gonna be a giant box of baits. And there's a note in here. Really want to thank you, Couriers and Oh no, it's for guns oh. and chicken strips! Oh. No! <laughs> Did you know it was for you? No. Money isn't always abundance. I know you're working and getting your camera gear all lined up. Well, all right, all right, all right. We are actually at the range today. I bought a new gun. I'm kind of interested. What gun, what caliber gun for all you gun nuts out there who watch this channel? What caliber gun do you think I ended up buying? This is an actual sniper rifle. That's well, I, what, what I consider to be a sniper rifle for sure. It's in that case right there. You guys tell me what caliber it is. Sarah's going to shoot it. Jimmy's going to shoot it. It's only 100, 100 yards, so it's really not that big of a deal. We're just going to make sure it's nice and sighted in. I'll let you know if you do it. So clean. <laughs> so clean. How's that trigger pull? Oh, it's so nice. I mean, look at that. Yeah. I will say it's a little off. Um, quite a bit off, actually. I think I'm putting rounds on top of each other now. On top of each other? I think so. <laughs> now it is Sarah's turn to give this thing a shot. I think the biggest rifle she's ever shot with my scar, so it should be, it should be, should be pretty interesting to say the least. All right, Sarah, you ready? No, it doesn't hurt that bad. You're good. Okay. You ready? Yeah. You need to go up and down at all. Put your hand, that one hand on here, or this hand's on the, where the trigger is. You're, you're gripping it way too tight. You, need to just... you ready? Hold on, I gotta find it again. Uh, that pushed me off the table for sure. Yeah. Now all the way forward. There you go. Now you're, you got it. you're good. Well, that was a good time. We got uh, got the target here. I'll show you guys what kind of damage Sarah did. She did hit one in the orange, which I give her a, like an insane amount of credit for because this is a 300 wood mag. I don't know if you guys know much about 300 wood mag, and this is a bull pup on top of that, so it will kick your ass if you're new to shooting. Which is really, I'm really glad that she got the got the kahunas to get behind the gun. So yeah, I'll show you guys this here in a second. All right, so this is what Sarah shot. She hit the orange right there. She shot those two right there. 
I shot, I got it started here. It went to, no, excuse me, excuse me, I lied. I went to here, came up too much, went down too much, and then readjusted. This is the final grouping, and that's the final shot. So, if I was a gambler, man, I'd say I think this gun shoots a half a minute subgroup. Okay, let's make this for lamest. Shoots a half inch shot group at uh, 100 yards. So if it's gonna shoot a half inch shot group at uh, 100 yards, you're looking at, you know what I'm saying? Like you're looking at like a, a five inch. You know, just put this in perspective. At a thousand yards, that's a five inch shot group. Five inches. Like put a circle on your piece of paper and measure five inches. And that little tiny circle is the equivalent of what this gun will shoot, shot group wise, at a thousand yards. This gun is insanely just. It's, oh, it's so amazing, the, the accuracy about it. But it also comes down to who's behind the gun as well, because triggers pull and squeeze and, and jerking and everything else comes into play when you're shooting at distances that far, which hopefully here in the future I'll be able to. That's another thing I wanna ask you guys. Is there anybody that follows this channel that has anywhere to hog hunt or long distance shoot? I got 10 steel targets and I got a spotting skill coming. I just don't have an area where I can go out and I can shoot. 10 to 15 football fields comfortably with a 300 wood mag so I don't you know what I mean if you guys do have anywhere to hog hunt do any type of hunting and or shooting here in Texas please send guns and chicken strips at gmail.com an email I'll link it down below shoot them an email let's uh let's go and let's go shooting together I'm pretty excited for this gun all right all right you know what we're gonna do well for one we're gonna enjoy a nice refreshing Coors Light talk about good old-fashioned guns which we're not gonna do because this is an unboxing. I so love guns. Guns are good. So you guys have sent me a whole bunch of stuff that he's going to help me unbox. So the last time you guys saw me, we were on a range shooting this badass weapon. Now this thing, I'm telling you guys right now, this gun, like look how sexy this thing is. American flag subdued. Just listen to this. Oh. 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 That is so sweet. Oh. A trigger pull makes you feel like the gun wants to shoot itself. It's just so crisp and so smooth. So nice. <laughs> if, you look, if you look out in his front yard right now, in his driveway, there's exploded ones of those because he just ran them over. I just ran them over. Why do you leave these at my house? Stop leaving them at my house. Yeah. That's awesome shirt. Sure. Zero Fox shot. This is pretty awesome. Okay, so I'm, I'm PFC fail. Over in Afghanistan, I'm really glad I can actually fill some sort of void for you for not being able to fish on your first deployment. That shit's easy, dude. You'll 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 fly. The, the things, those deployments fly by so fast. If you're busy, if you're not busy, then they probably drag on like. Yeah, that could suck. I hope you're enjoying yourself in Afghanistan. I did. I absolutely loved it. So we just want to. What's crazy? Joe Brailer. He's in the Navy. He's in E4. He's been watching me since since I had a thousand subs, which is amazing. He sent me this. It's crazy to see people stick around for that long. I'm interested. How long have you guys been around? I know we asked early in this video, what do you guys think the caliber of this gun is, which I should probably tell you that is a 300 Win Mag. But I want to know what, how, how long have you guys been around? If you guys are still watching this far in the video, you probably kind of enjoy these videos for some odd reason. And I'm kind of interested. When did you subscribe? This guy's been around for a thousand subs. And this is going up on my wall. It's amazing. I have a Valentine. I'm going to tell Sarah that she's uh, going to have to take a break this year because Olivia bought alone, you know, uh, just sent uh, me a Valentine's Day again, you know. Nicolo Sakao, you wanted me to sign and send you something back. I don't really have like a lot of stuff laying around, but I have this stuff. It's worth next to nothing and it will not work very well for really much anything. So I'm going to sign and send you this back. Wow, oh, that's actually signed really well. Normal pull toilet paper wouldn't allow you to sign like that. But you now have the only Lunkers TV signed toilet paper there is in the world. Okay, we're on the very, very, very last one of today's video. Who is it from? Where we got? Where we got? What do we got? Jake Kelly. Is that chicken for me? Jimmy, can you sign this? The very last one. The very last one is for you. <laughs> <laughs> oh, dude, it says give to Jimmy in the bottom. Oh. Neither of us saw that when both read it. It's for you. Is your first thing ever? This first thing this ever. This is history. Dude, this is a big deal. Mm. What the 
hell is that? That's my signature. His signature's worth millions, by the way, if you didn't know that. That's, that's my amazing signature. One of these days, you'll understand why that signature is worth millions. Okay. I'm absurdly tired. I've got to get up at 5 in the morning to go fishing on uh, Lake Fork tomorrow. We're going to be going deep. Uh, today was kind of like a chill hot day. Shoot this gun that I've got. Hung out with him. Hung out with the wife. Hung out with the, my daughter. Um, it was just, you know, it's just one of those days you guys get to chill. Today was Saturday. Tomorrow is going to be Sunday. You guys are watching the Super Bowl, I'm sure, right now. And if you're not, if it's past the Sunday, you know what? Go back and watch the other video. Because this one was kind of So. With that being said, guys, I'll see you guys tomorrow. Thanks for watching this little bit of unboxing. A little bit of, you guys need to see this new soft rifle. This is a big deal to me. This is a freaking 300 wood mag. This thing, I mean, look at this. Look at this round. This is just pure sexiness right here. Like, look at that. It's beautiful.